A no sound problem generally indicates that you have a driver issue. Um, so what I would recommend that you do is go to your manufacturer's website, Dell or HP or, or whoever, and download the most up-to-date driver from their website for your particular model. Models are generally on the front of the machine. Um, this goes for the same for laptop or, uh, or desktop. And then um, if you have a specific uh, newer sound card that you put in yourself, go to that particular manufacturer's website and download the, the driver there. And then that should fix your problem. If it doesn't, then do you know, something that's insane, sometimes so painfully obvious that it doesn't really um, click with you. Check the actual connections on the machine. Also, a good test is to take an iPod or CD player or anything with a headphone jack and plug it into the, yellow, or the green connector that's on your speakers to make sure your speakers are working correctly as well. Sound card problems generally uh, originate from malware being uh, on your machine. Um, some malware will attack the sound driver itself and, and delete it from the system, and you have to manually re-add it. So uh, one good deterrent uh, uh, to keeping this from happening is, is to get you know, up-to-date antivirus and malware protection like SpyBot or, or uh, Adware. And also uh, make sure those, those programs are up-to-date.